It's a beautiful day here, folks. The sun is going down and the lights are on. That's right, Jim. The parking lot is packed. Tailgate parties are in full swing. Yep. The ushers are handing out programs and the seats are filling up. Rick, I believe we're going to see some great performances tonight. Absolutely. The players are already warming up and we're about ready to start. Listen, Jim. Hmm. The crowd's already started singing. They have. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Absolutely. Join the crowd this summer at the Santa Fe Opera. This is dedicated to our relatives before us and those to come. To those who carry on their traditions and live strong among their people. To our children at home and in the classroom. To those who are in need of services such as health care. To our relatives who depend upon the senior centers, housing and child care. To those living in urban areas and Indian communities other than reservations. To those that speak and who continue to be heard. To our people who know that the census can be our voice. Once again the time to participate in Census 2000 has come. By participating the voice of our American Indian communities, our ancestors and generations of Indian people to come will be heard. If we do not participate, we may not receive the services and programs we need. In the circle of life, we speak not only for ourselves, but for all our Indian people. Generations are counting on this. Don't leave it blank. Paid for by Census 2000. Being a kid is tough. They're always looking for respect. But do we really know what respect is? To me, respect is what I feel inside for my father and mother. Respect is what I feel when I make choices. Respect is what I feel on the inside for my elders. Respect is what I feel for my culture and health. But most of all, when somebody offers me drugs and I say no, now that's respect. Oh yeah, and it's also when your mom says nice nose ring. Doing drugs is not the American Indian way. Respect yourself, your culture, and your tribe. Respecting myself is my anti-drug. Sponsored by the Office of National Drug Control Policy. It seems the folks at the Santa Fe Opera have made the outrageous claim that there are no bad seats in the new theater. Raymond does not believe this, and to prove it, he is going to test all the seats. Ready, Raymond? Oh, yes. I see and hear you just fine. I see and hear you just fine. Mm-hmm. Hey, you can see really well from over here. I told you so. And the balcony. What a great view. While everyone knows that with the new roof, opera titles in English at every seat. Oh, these seats are really comfortable. Mm-hmm. Raymond will never find a bad seat, as there are none. Oh, there are none. Come to the Santa Fe Opera and see it all from any seat in the house. Yes. My, my first name, Simona, is in Hopi and it means little blue flower girl. And my last name is in Hopi too, and it means um, Aretha, blue flowers. I don't want drugs to be a part of my life. Most of the reason why I want, I want to become an actress is so that um, I can show everybody that Native Americans are as good as everybody else, and we can become something. 
I want to do all kinds of movies and commercials and be on magazines. And my set of friends, we don't think it's cool or anything. If we do drugs, it's hard to resist, <laughs> to say no. But then um, I think if you have like respect for yourself, then you'll be able to say no. I like acting because it's fun. I can be who I am. And when I grow up, I want to become an actress. And that is my anti-drug. Sponsored by Office of National Drug Control Policy and Partnership for a Drug-Free America. It's time to unite as one tribe. To count how we have grown stronger to celebrate our future. Participating in Census 2000 may ensure programs and services needed in our communities. Generations are counting on this. Don't leave it blank. Cody's the name. I'm 14 and I play ball. And I don't smoke cigarettes. I'm not a big star or even a state champ, but I'm strong, healthy, and have potential. Cody's the name and I don't smoke cigarettes. Our children are too young to know the need for new health care facilities. Kids cannot understand why we need to prepare for the growing population on their reservations. Children do not realize how important it is for a new American Indian Center. But if you take the time to participate in Census 2000, our children's needs will be known. Generations are counting on this. Don't leave it blank. My name's Amanda. I'm a shawl dancer. To dance takes a lot of work and decisions. When the competition is over, I am proud of all my decisions. I don't smoke cigarettes. I'm a child dancer. When we dream, we imagine a place. When we dream, we dream for the future of our children. When we dream, we imagine the opportunity of education, health care, and more. By participating in Census 2000, you may ensure programs and services for generations to come. Generations are counting on this. Don't leave it blank. I'm a Native American. I'm proud. I'm proud of who I am. I'm strong. I'm healthy. I'm proud. I make certain decisions. I don't smoke cigarettes. I'm strong. I don't smoke cigarettes. I'm a Native American. I'm healthy. I'm pro. I don't smoke cigarettes. I'm a role model. I am a role model. I make certain decisions. I'm strong and healthy. I am pro. And I don't smoke cigarettes. Raymond is too young to understand the need for health facilities, schools, housing, and roads. Yet Raymond's grandma explains that by taking a few minutes to answer a few questions, one can affect the circle of life and be certain that the native voice is not silent. By participating, everyone is assured that the services and programs will be in place for years to come. Generations are counting on this. Don't leave it blank. Mexico, we lose over 300 people a year to guns. Help keep concealed weapons out of Albuquerque. Right about now, the funk soul brother. Check it out now, the funk soul brother. Right about now, the funk soul brother. Check it out now, the funk soul brother. Right about now, about now, about now. About now.
100 seasons of global basketball. Be a part of the tradition. Hey.